How are you guys? This is IBU Learning, the place to develop your CAD BIM skills. In today's video, I am going to show you how you can utilize your Revit uh, uh, model in the class structure. Suppose if you have any framing in the Revit the steel structure and uh, you want it to export in the, the class structure and uh, use the connection and other things in there. So here you go. I have one model already in the last tutorial I prepared this one so I will just go to use this same I open this the same model if you go in the 3D this is the truss I prepared so just I am going to use this first I will just go to VG and just I hide all annotation so I will just keep only 3D I will hide this ok so this is 3d we have now I will go to file and then export option and from here you will see you can export AutoCAD PDF but here I will choose IFC once I will select IFC it is asking file name and path where you want to save so I will save file still framing same and I say ok and then start export this is finished because this is a small mm, just model so it's just finished very quick so once finished I will just switch to the class structure so I am just going to open again the class structure I just go to open new model and I can say exported Revit model I create one new file ok so I have the class structure open this is showing view 1 3d view so from here just I will go to hover over the reference model ok this is showing the information what is this just click on this reference model and you can add the model from here just go to browse and where is the model this is the model just select and open for the origin and uh, location and a scale I will keep as it is because my model was in the Revit it was in uh, MM already so I don't need to change anything here and then I will click add model once I click added it's again reverse to the Revit but I will just go to again switch to the class structure once I move to the class structure I see my Revit model is showing as it is here in the class structure but this is the reference if I will switch here close this it's gone so this is like having a link reference model here everything looking good just I will go to select this model and I will move to manage tab from manage you can see there convert IFC object if you will see the information what is that convert IFC object to native object so just click on this icon and tackle start processing then you can see all the profile is highlighted and the information is given here
Now next step just select all, control A, select all and then apply changes. Once you will select this one, hide this and you can see where all the model element is showing here. Now just go to close this dialog and then here we can see all the elements is converted into the Tecla object. If you will go to see the properties of this beam, it is showing the beam UV 305, 102 and 25. So all the information is showing and now this model is itself converted in Tecla structure and here you can do whatever connection and other things detail we have to do. Even you can uh, control F for application and component and then here you can say base plate if you want to make the base plate here and here you go you have base plate control R to rotate at this point and then you can modify this property so like this you can use Revit model in the class structure for detailing and even for further modeling or for fabrication thanks for watching Please subscribe for upcoming videos. Thank you.